Hi there, this is a quick video just to show you another way of altering the fields, the attributes in QGIS. When you right hand mouse click on these OpenStreetMap theatres, for example, and go to Properties, I can click on Source Fields. I can see my fields and the type and the name, etc. Uh, if I click on Edit, I can um, click and rename um, and make a few other changes there. I'll just turn edit off. But what you may want to do is to um, reorder these fields and also have a bit more power uh, over editing the actual attributes. So there's uh, a tool in the processing toolbox called Refactor. So I'll just type Refactor there. It's in the Vector Table Tools in the processing toolbox. Uh, this is all in QGIS 3. Um, It's Madeira. Uh, so run refactor, and here you get a, a bit more power uh, to do stuff on the attributes. So, and one of those things, you select your layer in the input layer at the top there. Uh, one of those things is to say, well, actually, the name I'd like at the uh, as the first attribute, the first column. So I can just push it up to the top, as well as altering the type, etc. So you may actually prefer this tool. Uh, and obviously it gives you the reorder as well uh, to the actual tool when you just go to properties of a layer. So this is the refactor fields tool. You can even load a whole new set of fields from a different layer and overwrite all the, of these. But anyway, I'll um, you see. Um, I'll just run this. So name's now at the top there. That would be refactored. Uh, that's the name of the temporary file that would be called. But I could click anything um, in there and rename it or what have you. Uh, that runs very quick. You see it's created a table, a layer called refactored, which is a temporary one. Uh, if I just go to the properties of that, you can now see names at the top and it's all the data. If I uh, go to the theatres again, you'll see name was uh, the third one down. And it's the same data. So if I click, if I turn off theatres and just click on my refactored layers, um, Just highlight uh, refactored. So now names at the top. The uh, if you notice there actually when I clicked it showed theatres because uh, the highlighter uh, I I clicked on the layer and that's why when I clicked it actually showed the name still sort of down there and that's because it got it from OSM theatres even though it's not displayed and that's one thing to remember when using QGIS. So you, you select the layer you're actually interested in with the info tool and um, and then click and it uh, also hovers with the name there and there it is name is uh, the first attribute in the list which um, is not straightforward to do actually in something like ArcGIS uh, it's um, but it's very very simple in QGIS as you, as you can see so I'll, I'll, I'll do another video later on about uh, the info tool and uh, a bit more the way you can customize that and bring up data etc but anyway i hope that's uh, useful so it's refactor fields the key thing i use it for is just to reorder the fields hope you find that useful thank you